Hey everybody, this is Praxis, and today it's still kind of cold. It was sort of snowy this morning, and it's definitely windy, so I've been continuing to work inside the house because we've got three days of relative warm and not windy coming up uh, after today, so I'm going to be working on the greenhouse stuff, uh, you know, starting tomorrow. But uh, I've been taking advantage of today doing wall boards on the inside. If you look behind you, I finished up over the bathroom sink and the upstairs bathroom and the ceiling. Uh, There's a good nine inch kind of place to, to hide things up there. I had thought about doing an access hatch, but I just didn't end up doing it. Making an access hatch or panels that can kind of get removed, it's a lot more complicated than just boarding things up. You know, you can put a lot up there. I mean, it's a perfect place for throwing up rifles, with the exception of the fact that it's near the bathroom and there'd be humidity up there. But, uh, you know, it'd be a great hiding place, but I don't think I'm going to take advantage of that. we got other hiding places, and we can utilize those. Uh, you know, they don't even have to be in your house. You can have hiding places out in the woods. Who, who's even going to look there? So, uh, I've just been doing that today, uh, doing wall boards. I'm about to work on this area uh, over the bathtub. I know it's really dark, probably can't see over there. But I've been holding off on that because there's a lot of uh, complex boards. Like this one here is going to go just above the uh, shower enclosure. And it needed to have this uh, area in the back kind of shaved off and then it kind of radiuses around here. Kind of complicated stuff. Uh, and Well, at least more complicated than just cutting a board and throwing it up. So I, I haven't jumped on it, but doing it now because I'm running out of things to do and that's a good situation to be in. Uh, there's not really that much left to do in terms of interior boards. I'm going to use up the pile that I've got down there on everything and then I got to think about uh, moving that pile out of the house and you know keeping it dry because it's all nice dry wood I don't want it to rot and I'm going to be using a bunch of that for the shelving in the pantry so I got to hold on to it for that but other than that I've just been doing boarding today it's kind of weird because today at the time of recording it's election day here in the United States and uh, it's the first election day I haven't gone out to vote I already voted uh, through mail-in ballot uh, a while ago so it's a little bit anticlimactic uh, but you know I'm making good use of the time uh, just a little bit of a, a news coming up in a couple of days. It looks like we're going to have the people come and drill the hole uh, to help me out with the radon situation. They're going to be drilling a hole through the side of the foundation. It's a little bit um, unconventional the way that I'm solving the problem, uh, but I think it's going to be a really good solution. And I will share that process with you guys when that happens just in a couple of days. That's it. Thanks for watching.